what's going on guys um i'll let you see what i got going on today um wanted to show you guys how to wire up your obd2 scan port um and your ls swap what i got so far is your ecu connector the blue connector um, pins 58 it's kind of hard to see if you look inside of here if you look inside of here they're all numbered pins 58 your green wire is your serial data port connector okay this will go to pin 2 on your OBD2 port sorry guys it's kind of cold out here Pins 5 and 6, or sorry, pins 4 and 5 on your OBD2 port are grounds. You can connect both of those together. These here are going to be your ground wires. Um, pin 16 is this bottom corner. It's an orange wire. That's going to be your 12 volt constant power which I have found that pin 57 right next to 58 the orange wire if you follow that out here that's your constant power so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take pin 2 from your serial data port connector which is the purple wire and splice that into the screen wire, which is pin 58 on the blue connector of your ECU or PCM. Um, and your 12 volt constant wire on your OBD2 port will be pin 57 on the blue connector for your PCM. I got pins four and five splice together that I will be wiring to a ground and I'll show y'all here in a second how this all works all right guys I want to show you got my OBD2 port here I'm gonna be keeping it under the engine bay um, pin number two your serial data connector which is your purple wire I've ran to Pin number 58, which is the dark green wire that comes off of your blue, the blue side of your PCM connector. Um, I have my orange constant power ran to pin 57, which is constant power um, from your, your PCM on the blue side also. I have, a gr I have both grounds looped together and grounded here on the side of the the body I know it's a good ground um, I'll show you guys and plug up the scan tool powers on go in here Touch your ignition on. And your scan tool will work. See, I got a lot of codes going on here. That's also because I'm using the Turbo 350 Trans with a stock PCM. And I'm not running a mass airflow. Yep, mass airflow. I was in plug I was unplugging the injectors, trying to figure out which one was bad the other day. I'm not running an EGR. And of course, no EVAP. Um, 
using turbo 350 trans so that's what's going on with all that um but that is how you wire in your obd2 port thanks guys for watching please like and subscribe i appreciate it and uh also i'm gonna let you know what i got going on here i'm probably gonna be putting the door panels on today do a video of that got the door panels here so i'll clean them all up and get that done thanks guys